Um, I wanted to know what yeah. right on the teaser point Guys. that the president says he feels vindicated with your commentary that Senate Intel has not found anything so far on the Trump collusion with Russia. Just saying what factually we found to date. We haven't finished with our investigation, um, and I think. Uh, just recently, I think the, the, there was a story that said the Democrat uh, staff confirmed that that's where we were. Well, we've still got some investigation left. How much longer do you think uh, until we see a final report? Well, that's hard to say because I don't know how long it's going to take to, to, to write two years worth of report and to go through a declassification process, which is what I want to do because I want the American people to see the facts. Good morning. Let me say this with a great deal of confidence. It is clear the Russian government was looking for the vulnerabilities in our election system, highlighted and, and highlighted some of the key gaps. There's no evidence that any vote was changed. Russia attempted to penetrate 21 states. We know they were successful in penetrating at least one voter database. For being here, I want to thank my colleagues, especially uh, who were with Mark and I this morning. Wow, wow, thank you, thank you. He's making sure that Americans stay safe. He moved quickly to stop that virus at its borders before we even knew what it was. The president stopped flights from China, and experts agree that was the number one thing that has slowed the approach of this to our country. We went on offense. At the same time, Joe Biden was calling him xenophobic. Can you imagine if Joe Biden were president and that virus had come into our country quickly? This is what we're looking at, folks. Now is the time for us to unite against the radical left. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make sure everyone knows I'm there working for them. I am humbled for all of the support here, and I'm going to continue to work hard to earn it.